All right, g'day guys, welcome to the 2021 AFL Season Quiz Round 8 Edition on the True Footy YouTube channel. Today, I am hosting at the top of Round 9, so for context, we haven't started Round 9, so all the stats are updated to the start of Round 9. In the blue corner, we've got Daniel Busher. How are you, Busher? Good, mate. Yourself? Yes, very well. Uh, we do need a, you to nominate a buzzer for this, because we are going to have to buzz in option. What are you, you going to do? Bush. Bush. All right, Lenny, welcome to the show it, from the red corner. How are you feeling? Oh, look at those uh, guys. A little bit nervous, mate. Really? Uh, it's a bit of a quiz, yeah, and hopefully do all right. It's a different kind of pressure here on the True Footy YouTube yeah, channel, it's, but it's, you are coming up against Bush. Yeah. So it's, That's why I'm nervous. you got more to lose. Yeah, that's very true. <laughs> what would your bu uh, buzzer be today, Lenny? I'll go Zaz. All right, so the format for today's video is we're going to roll through 10 questions. It's going to be short and sharp. Some will be multiple choice, um, and some will just be sort of like closest to the pin scenario. Whoever buzzes in first gets to answer the question. If I haven't finished reading the question and all the choices, the person who buzzes in still has to answer it. And if he gets it wrong, then I can continue giving the options for the other person, if that makes sense. No so way. only one person can get an answer right because it's you know the first person to answer. If we are tied at the end, I do have a tie break question. We all good with that, gentlemen? Yep. Yes, sir. Good. Fantastic. All right. So let's kick off with the first question of the day. In round five, GWS beat the Swans by two points in the Sydney Derby. Who kicked the winning goal? Zaz. Josh Kelly. Yeah, that is correct. Lenny is on the board with the first answer correct. So one to zip. <laughs> Bush, how are you feeling? I wasn't optimistic before, but that's Got you with a left start. foot jab there. Jab there. Am I? Yeah, I feel just... like Ben Askren against Jack Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you're quite at that point yet. Question two. Who is third in the Coleman count after eight rounds? A. Bush. Yep. Uh, <laughs> okay, that's who's third. Okay. Hmm. 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 Josh Bruce? I don't believe it. He's correct. <laughs> Bush is back, baby. <laughs> one and one. The other options were Ben King, Josh Bruce, uh, Tabernard, or Oscar Allen I was going to throw in as a little one. So we're one and one after two questions. Yes. Let's go to question three. The Anzac Day Clash recorded the highest attendance this year. This question is closest to the pin. I'll let you both answer. What is your guess for the attendance? The person who gets the nearest answer is correct. 73,500. 81,000. Quick maths on my part. This has put incredible pressure on the host. I believe Lenny is correct. The correct answer is 78,113. So Lenny is up two to one. Question four. Who leads the league in tackles after eight rounds? A, Jack Steele. B, Jack Graham. C, Hugh Greenwood, or D, Took Miller? Bush. Hugh Greenwood. Ding, 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 ding. It's a neck and neck, people. Two and two after Ooh. four rounds. Correct. I really want someone to get one wrong so I can say, wah, 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 wah. <laughs> but so far you guys have been on the money. Question five. After showdown 49, the showdown tally is split at 25 to 24. Who leads? Zaz. Port Adelaide. Correct. Three to two. You're going, you're going, you're trading. Tip for tat. Yeah, tip yeah. for tat at the moment. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it's three, two to Lenny at the midpoint. How's the sweat situation, Butcher? Getting good. Not too bad though. Thanks to the Manscaped ball deodorant. Nice. And then we'll take this opportunity to announce that this quiz is brought to you by our sponsors, Manscaped. You get 20% off using the code TRUEFORTY20, all caps, all one word at checkout, and you'll get 20% off and free shipping. Back to the show. Question six. Hawthorne recorded a massive comeback to beat Essendon in round one. What was the margin that they trailed by? Zaz, 42 points. Busher, would you like to hear the options? Yes, please. A, 37 points. B, 39 points. C, 41 points. Or D, 44 points. I'm going to go A. A, 37 points. <laughs> <laughs> Unless I'm mistaken, but from what I checked this morning, it was 39 points is the correct answer. So, after six questions, it's still three to two, and Lenny has the lead. Fuck, I only put down ten questions. I didn't even have a tiebreaker, so I really <laughs> hope you guys don't die. <laughs> <laughs> Question seven. How many one-point margin games have we seen in 2021? A. Two. B. Three. C. Four. Or D. Six. Bush. A. Wow, 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 wow. Lenny, you have a free shot. I'm going to go with B. Ding! 
<laughs> Correct. <laughs> Lucky number three. <laughs> Correct. He lo- moves into a lead of four to two. Bush, you have to get the last two correct to force a tie break. Oh, yeah. And I, uh, I really hope you don't because I don't <laughs> forgot the question. <laughs> <laughs> this next question, question eight. This is the closest to the pin question. GWS versus St. Kilda was the lowest attendance this year. What was the attendance of that game? I'm going to say that question's a false premise because what about the Fremantle North Melbourne game in the Derby? Yeah, okay. So you lose points for being a smart aleck. No, okay. For games where they allowed a crowd, what the GWS St. Kilda was the lowest okay. attendance. So closest to the pin. Where was it played? Are we allowed that uh, This was in Sydney. SCG? No. It was uh, the Giant Stadium, I believe. 9,001. I'm going to go with 11,000. 11,000. Bush actually wins. It was considerably lower than both of what you said. It was 5,014 people. 3-4. Three, 3-4, four. Three, four, baby. Busher, Ooh. you need to get this right to force a draw and potential tiebreaker. <laughs> force you to come up with another question. <laughs> I'll have to fucking be quick. <laughs> question 10. The final question. What AFL record did Adelaide break in round six in their loss to Hawthorne? And to make it really tough, no multiple choice. Because I forgot. Bush. Most accurate kicking or something? was it? Yes. Most accurate kicking? You're on the right track, but I wanted a bit more specific. How many goals in a row? 15 in a row, I believe it was before they missed. Oh, I'll pay it. I think, you, I think that's fair. I think that's fair. Ding, ding, ding. We're forcing it into a tiebreaker, guys. Ooh. This has lived up. This has lived up. Clutch, baby. The tiebreaking question is multiple choice. Whoever gets it right wins this quiz as... Ted barks exuberantly in the background. Someone must have let him out of the house. Quite a lot of atmosphere in this. Feels like a full MCG right now. <laughs> full of dogs. The tie-breaking question. What is North Melbourne's closest losing margin so far in 2021? Zaz, 19 points. It's technically incorrect. Do I get to hear options now? You do get to hear options. Ooh. This has gone down to the wire. Can you do the dun 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 dun? Uh, if it, uh, who wants to be a millionaire? Question music. <laughs> Your options are this, Busher. A, eight points. B, twelve points. C, seventeen points. Or D, eighteen points. If you get this wrong, I'm really fucked because I really don't have any other questions. <laughs> <laughs> who did they? Who was they playing? Let me go B. <laughs> now this was unforeseen you're still drawn after the tie breaking question if you bear with me one second i will come up with Bush, it's, it's been a wonderful <laughs> <laughs> very tight very competitive i love it oh shut the hell up you fluffy dickhead here's one that you should guys both get all right so there, we will have a winner in my opinion after this question who leads the league after eight rounds for most possessions. Zaz, Zach Merritt. Do I get options or do you I do. choke again? I'll give you some options. Lovely. Now don't choke again. <laughs> Is it A, Tom Mitchell? Is it B, Clayton Oliver? Is it C, Ollie Wine? I already know who it is, Jack McRae. Busher, against all odds, has emerged victorious <laughs> against the guru that is Lenny Pogliani. Good game, Great game. Great game. Oh, yeah. Very I'm tough. just going to go home and cry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've ever won a quiz that I've been involved with uh, on YouTube, whether it be my channel or someone else's, so I know exactly how you feel, Lenny, especially it's, when you're the favourite. someone else. You don't even give Drewzy the plug there. Come on, son. <laughs> yeah, oh, no, no, but there's been multiple across multiple channels. Like, yeah, yeah so um, I suck. And so does Lenny. You all suck. I'm the champion. And I'm betting it was bloody sister who let the dog out now that I can see what's going on out there. All right. Congratulations, Busher, on being crowned quiz champion. We will do more of these throughout the season, maybe mid-year or later in the season. Not too sure yet. Lenny, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. It's been fantastic. And uh, yeah. Yeah, A few challenges for me, mate. We'll make it a thing. Someone can knock me off, baby. I'm the king. Oh, jeez. All right. Here we go. (laughs) (laughs) This is like the YouTube boxing scene, except nerdier. (laughs) Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you in the future. See you soon. Thank you.